Hello everyone, this is Ninja Girl, so I'm win here, back with my Wings Club for the Game Boy Advance Let's Play. And last time we just played through the first episode of the entire series with Bloom, meaning Stella, and learning that she is in fact a fairy. And Stella took her here to Althea College for Fairies. And we already met our headmistress, Miss Farragonda. She is a very, very awesome headmistress. And yeah, she told us where everything is in the school, so we can actually do a bit of exploring before heading upstairs, which is where the dorms are, so I figured that's what we would do this episode. I did, of course, crop the video a little bit better in OBS. I do apologize for the black bars there on the side, but that was the best way to ensure everything on the screen fit in, and it wasn't just some of it cut off, you know? I know some people have a way to put images in the background, but I don't know how to do that. Anyway, but yeah, let's take a look around here. Here's the Grand Hall. Suddenly it's empty right now, though. Huh. But very nice. Althea looks really good for being on the Game Boy Advance. It does look better in the PC version, but... Still. This looks great. Ooh, yeah, these rooms. They'll be important later. You'll see. And, of course, here's the library, like Miss Ferragana pointed out. Oh, yeah, there's actually side quests you can do right off the bat, I think. Welcome to the Althea Library, young lady. I am Professor Dufour. I think that's the right pronunciation. Hello, Professor. My name is Bloom. Ah, Bloom. You're a new student from Earth. It has been quite a long time since we've seen a fairy from Earth here at Althea. In fact, I didn't think there were any fairies left on Earth. Ah, now that is an important plot point for the fourth season. But, uh, yeah. I won't spoil that. You've heard of Earth? Oh, yes. We even have a small section of Earth literature, but all of it was transferred to Cloud Tower a little while ago. If you ever need help finding anything, or finding any books, just ask and I'll help you. As best I can. Thank you, Professor. I'll do that. Sweet. She's cool. Ooh, classroom. We get plenty of sunlight in our classrooms. That's nice, actually. Some classrooms do block off windows and just have doors with a little window in it, you know. I think if you talk to her again, that will initiate the side quest. Yep, here it is. <sighs> Darn those three girls. Oh, hello, Bloom. I need help with something. Would you mind giving me a hand? Sure, Professor DeFour. What can I do? Amaril, Spica, and Hortensia all have overdue books, which are in high demand. Could you collect them for me? There's your first little fetch quest. There's a few of them in this game. Some of them are also in the PC version as well, like finding Stella's earrings, stuff like that. Let's see, where are they? I must try and remember. I think Hortensia... I think she had a different name in the, uh, 4 kids stuff, but, uh, Hortensia, I think, is in the other side over here. Or not. Maybe it's a different room, but yeah, in this area somewhere. No? Nope. Are they all upstairs, then? Maybe. Okay then, I guess we are gonna go ahead and go upstairs. <laughs> that must be where they are. I thought they were all downstairs though. I guess not. I'm trying to avoid going up there, because I know that initiates a little cutscene. Of 
Okay, yeah. They must be downstairs then. And I must have missed them. I'll check all the rooms on the other side. They're bound to be in one of them. Let's see now. Empty. Oop. Get in there, Bloom. Ah, that's Miss Garagonda's office. But where are those three... Oh yeah, here's the uh, magical reality chamber. Professor Whisk is. Who teaches... Shape-shifting, basically. Where are those three? I accepted her quest. Hmm. Usually you can do this right off the bat. I know, I've done it before. Hmm. I have to be missing them somewhere. Let's see. Check here again. No. Maybe one, now that I've talked to the librarian, she'll be in the great hall here? If not, then they are upstairs and I'll have to initiate the cutscene first, I guess. But I could, I could have sworn that I've done it right off the bat before. Hmm. Yeah, I guess they're not here. At least not yet. Oh well. Too much for that little side quest. But... Just double checking in here again. No. Okay. Oh, Miss Faragonda's I know for a fact I can do right off the bat. Cause that's another one I know I did before. So, I'll go take on Miss Faragonda's little side quest. That's weird though. Oh well. This game is fun though. It's really cute. There's actually another Winx game for the Game Boy Advance, and that is Quest for the Codex, but that game is horrible. It's so repetitive. Anyway, Bloom, could you run to the library? I need three books for reference. The books are... How to get your dragon bone its whitest, magic wand, organization in six easy steps, and Flora and Fauna Black Mud Swamp. Okay, just making sure she didn't say anything else I needed to know. But, yep, those should all be right in the library, so no problem. No big, as Kim Possible would say. <laughs> Man, I love that show. There we go. There's one. Aha! There's the second one. Now, where is that last one? By the way, you do get, um, fireflies for this. That's why I'm doing it. Or, or dragon seeds, I think. Which I believe increase your health. Because unlike the uh, PC version, our health is represented by hearts, not a flower. It's it's weird. The heart system makes more sense though. The PC version didn't. Anyway, here you go, Miss Faragonda. Thank you, Bloom. I've been looking forward to reading these. Here's a new reward for your help. Thank you. Okay, it is a firefly. Thank you. Much appreciated. Alright, I guess until I can do the other side quest I tried to do, we'll go ahead upstairs and initiate that cutscene I was talking about. Oh yeah, Miss Griselda. Move along now. Let's not loiter. Don't you have something to do? Yes, ma'am. I suppose we do. But yeah, here are the Althea dorms. They're very nice. Here's all the rooms. Very cool. Ah, cutscene. 
Here we are! Wow! Ah, Flora, let's see. I like her four kids' voice more. It suits her, so... Hi there! Hi, my name is Bloom. This is Stella. Bloom, according to the arrangements, we'll be sharing a room together. My name is Flora. Looks like I've got a room to myself, same as last year. I wonder who's in the third room. Ah, uh, Musa. Lisa Ortiz. She was the best Musa voice. That would be us. I'm Musa. It's hard to imitate her. And I know people love British Techna. I guess I can try. And I'm Techna. Nice to meet you both. I'm Bloom. This is Flora and Stella. Oh, Mistress Griselda made sure everyone knew who Stella was. It seems there was an incident in one of the labs last year. It's still out of order. Griselda always blows things out of proportion. Well, as long as you warn us before you blow up and blow anything up, especially the apartment. <laughs> that was cute. I think I'm going to have a look around. A look around the school. See you all later. And now everyone is going to their proper room. Let's see. Aw, Kiko. You're so cute. Oh yeah, I believe that also initiates a death quest that you have to go back to Gardenia for. Yeah. Aw, Kiko. Kiko is always having a good time. Yeah, he's so cute. Adorable. Yeah. Yep, I was right. What's wrong with you, my poor Kiko? Aw. Kiko hasn't been eating well. I think he needs some plants from Earth. And then maybe, he'll feel a little bit better. Bring two of what you what you find, and I'll have a surprise for you. Ah, yeah. I know what he wants. And there are pictures around here, but are there any on Flora's side? No, it doesn't look like it. But yeah, this is so fun. And of course, all these characters will become the group known as the Winks. Stella, another Winx promo pick. Here's Stella doing a perfect Winx fairy pose. Yep, <laughs> that's Stella. Always trying to look her absolute best. On uh, this initiates Stella's. By the way, Bloom, have you seen my Sunstar earrings? I lost them and they're my favorites. Where do you think you lost them? I bet they fell off when that smelly ogre jumped me in the park. Yep. That quest is in the PC version as well. And PS2 version, obviously. I wish I did have the PS2 version. I'll bet that one's more fun. Cause, well, then again, if it's anything like the PC version, maybe not. Anyway, use that. Keep girls inspired me. I'm going to write a new tune about rabbits. Musa. Techna? What's up, Techna? Oh, I'm memorizing the seven, 17 precepts of translucionary dynamics, and I was trying to recite them backwards. <laughs> Studying already? Studying? Oh no, this is just for fun! <laughs> Yeah, that's Techna. <laughs> but hey, that's why we love her. She is smart and cool. And of course, the fairy of technology. Let's see, I think there's some more pictures in here. And then maybe we'll go downstairs and those three girls with the books the librarian wanted will be there. Should be, I would think. Anything in here? No? 
Guess not. Maybe those don't appear till a little later. We'll see. What's down here again? Okay, yeah, just the window. <laughs> okay. Nothing here, okay. We already talked to Griselda. So, okay, let's see if those three are out here. To get those books. Yeah, there's one. Hortensia. Hi, Hortensia. I'm looking for a library book that Professor Dufour needs. Sure, Bloom. I have the book right here. But first, you have to answer a question correctly. Which of the following is not one of the three magic schools in magics? Oh, please. Give me a challenge. I know Winks a little too well. You're right, Bloom. Cloud Fountain isn't a magic school. Here's that book you need. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, too easy. I know the show very well, and have done my research on it. I think Emerald's in here. Yeah, there she is. I don't think we even see her after the first season, do we? Or she doesn't really speak. She's in. She's a background character, I believe. Hi, Emeril. Professor Dufour sent me to get a book from you. Sure, Bloom. I have the book right here, but first you have to answer a question correctly. Who is the headmaster of Althea? Really? Nice try. Miss Farragonda. You're absolutely right, Bloom. Farragonda is the headmaster, or should I say, headmistress. Haha, <laughs> here's that book. Yeah, nice try. Like, Bloom will forget the headmistress. And here's Spica. Hi, Spica. I'm looking for a library book that Professor Dufour asked for. Sure, Bloom. I have a book right here, but... Okay, same dialogue. Who of the following is not one of the specialists? Ahem. <clears throat> That one. You're right, Bloom. Raven isn't a specialist. Here's that book you needed. Done. That was quick. Ha ha ha. Nice try. Now we can finish that little fetch quest. Thanks, Bloom. That's all of them. Here's a small gift for helping me. Helping me out. Okay. Thank you. Firefly. How many more until I level up again, anyway? Okay. Oh, this game is fun. Now. I may as well go ahead and start the next little task we have to do. And then I shall go ahead and end the video. But uh, yeah, we can go ahead and start our very first class. Right off the bat as well. At least after you talk to the girls. See, they're in there. Hello ladies, as you know, today's class will be held in Black Mud Swamp. I sent the other groups ahead. I do hope you're ready. Yeah. We can talk to the girls before we go though. Did you see Musa staring at Riven at the ball? She's got a crush, I'm sure. Aw uh, yeah, that's episode 3, Save the First Dance. That's the episode where Bloom first transforms. In both dubs. The Wranglish and Four Kids and... No, not the Nick dub. Special did it differently. Anyway. Stella? Oh, don't. <laughs> Can I not talk to Stella? Not even from that angle? Okay. Talk to Techna. This trip to the swamp should prove to be educational. Mm hmm. Yusa? I'm hoping to record some samples today. I got this great idea for a tune. Using cricket sounds. Hey, that's not bad, Musa. Okay. Well then, let's go. Do you wish to continue to Blackmon Swamp? Yes. Each group must make its way through Blackmon Swamp to a clearing in gloomy wood forest. White orbs will be a very useful spell in completing this assignment. And not simply for shooting away pesky mosquitoes. Ah, yes. 
We are now basically in the episode called The Voice of Nature. So yeah. Now I believe there's a save crystal, but where is it? Down here? I guess I do have to go down here first. Whoop. Down we go. And those pads, just like the PC version, activate help from one of the fellow winks. Don't worry, Bloom. I'll take care of it. Thanks, Flora. Okay. There we go. Now I can save. Ta-da! And yeah, you can go to Alfia anytime you want. If you want to go back and do something there. But, uh, yeah. I guess that'll do it for this part. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing Alfia a little bit, meeting the Winx, doing a couple side quests. But, uh, yeah. Guess next time we will be heading further in to Black Mud Swamp. And this time, unlike the PC version, I probably won't want to tear my hair out. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. But until then... I will see you guys later.